Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have another shop with me. And we are here at Marshalls, which I'm so excited for. Haven't been here in a little while. I usually always go to TJ Maxx, but Marshalls is like the sister to TJ Maxx. So you already know, my obsession is real. So we're gonna tackle on the makeup and skincare and see what hidden gems we can find today. So I'm excited, I hope you guys are too. As always, don't forget to grab a snack and let's start shopping together. Hopefully, there's not too many people and I'm not gonna get in trouble for vlogging. Hopefully, all right, let's go. Okay, so I am here in this section right here and I'm actually in desperate need of some new wipes. So I think I'm gonna get a few packs because they are pretty affordable and they have a huge variety of makeup wipes. When I film and when I'm taking off my makeup and everything, I usually use baby wipes, but since we're here, might as well stock up. So the ones that really caught my attention are these rose water ones. They're only $4, so I'm gonna pick these up. For 60 wipes, that's a pretty good deal. So I'm gonna try these out. I'm also seeing these back here. Coconut milk and almond, I'll take it. And these are also, oh, they don't have a price. I'm assuming these are $4 because all of them here say four dollars so I'm gonna get these as well okay and I'm gonna get cucumber if you know me you know cucumber and rose are my two favorite skincare scents so these are four dollars okay now we have some makeup brushes here I know I know I don't need any more makeup brushes trust me but this little highlighting duo from Japanesque is speaking to me so I'm gonna pick it up it's five dollars so 250 per brush I'll take it. The makeup brushes here are actually really, really good. Obviously, I don't need any more, but I just really wanted that little kit. But if you guys ever need some really good affordable ones, Marshalls, TJ Maxx is where it's at. Like this 10-piece brush set looks like a really nice set. And this is literally $15, which is such a steal for these makeup brushes. And they look really, really nice quality. I mean, they are. Like I said, I've tried many brushes from here. So these also look really good too. And they're only $13 for a nine-piece brush set. You can't beat that. Yay, more makeup. Okay, so they actually have quite a few things. Clinique Even Better Foundation. I really actually like this. How much is this here? $9. They have some random shades though. That's a good foundation. We have some Too Faced Sunny Bunny Natural Bronzer. I'm pretty sure that was limited edition. There's also Pacifica Bronzer Duo. Looks really, really pretty. Tahari. What is this? Ooh, this looks really, really pretty. How much is this? I never heard of this brand before. $5? I'll get it. We also have some Smashbox stick foundation. I didn't know that they had stick foundations. More Too Faced back here. Candlelight Glow. Huh, there's me. There's also some Physicians Formula. Absolute New York. Anastasia. This is my favorite blush. Every single time I come to TJ Maxx or Marshalls, I see this blush and it's the best peachy love and it's only $11. I already have like two backups of that, but that blush is amazing. Makeup Revolution and then there's more Anastasia down here. They're cream contour kits. Um, sorry about the music, it's like super loud in here, but um, we found some Becca and some Bare Minerals and Too Faced Peach Collection down here. This is crazy. I wonder if this is limited edition. Melting powder blush. Oh my god, the music's really loud in here. Okay, so there's Profusion back there as well as some Makeup Revolution. I think I'm gonna get this palette, the Ultra Pro Glow 2. It's only $5 and it looks really, really pretty. Okay, so I actually used to really love Burt's Bees lip balm when I was in high school, so I'm gonna grab this. It is $2.39 and it's orange flavor, so go with it. There is some e.l.f. back here, Maybelline Baby Lips Crayon, which I didn't know that they had that. And I found some Anastasia Matte Lipsticks. This is a set and it is $17. And you get a good variety of shades in here, like nudes and bright colors. I tried one of their lipsticks before. I wasn't a fan of it, but these look really pretty. Maybe I got a dud. I'm gonna try this out, because I love Anastasia. Okay, there's more Anastasia in here, more Too Faced. We have another matte lipstick set. This one is $15. And these are some brighter shades, which you guys know are not my thing, but they look really pretty. Um, this looks really cute. Too Faced Lip Injection Glossy. $6. This color looks like a really pretty like peachy color. It's called Babe Alert. 
let's get that. There's also some Urban Decay and more Becca here. So lots of like miscellaneous brands. And they also have Lorac here, which I used to love this brand concealer foundation pen and then they also have lipsticks here from Lorac which I love their lipsticks I haven't used them in a really really long time I believe this is limited edition though this is only ten dollars wow I don't really love to get limited edition stuff because then you guys can't really get your hands on it but looks really really pretty I do like their formula okay as soon as I push record the music gets louder but we're gonna have to just push through it so I found some more brushes and I know I know I don't need them, but this brush looks so good. Japanesque stippling brush. If you watch any of my videos, you know that these are my favorite kinds of brushes for blush, and this just looks perfect. And it's only $4, so. Found some more palettes from Color Bash Cosmetics, which I've never heard of before. But this looks really pretty. It's only $5, which isn't bad. We also have some Profusion, which I love their palettes. I don't love their packaging because it's a little bulky, but their stuff is really, really good. This looks gorgeous. This contour palette also looks really, really nice. You get some really cool shades in here, as well as uh, two highlight colors and some makeup brushes in here. The packaging, like I said, isn't amazing, but I love Profusion. This is $8. I'm gonna grab this. And then, we have some Stila up here, which I love. Their Magnificent Metals Glitter and Glow Liquid Shadows. These are amazing, and they actually have this color. Sunset Cove, I bought this at TJ Maxx. And they have a bunch of shades here. Okay, I can't help myself. I'm gonna get the Stila Metal Eyeshadow, and this one is in Into the Blue. It looks gorgeous, and it's only Eight bucks, I'm getting it. There's also some more Makeup Revolution here. Death by Chocolate Eyeshadow Palette. Looks really cute. There's more Profusion over here. I've actually tried this palette before. Not this color in particular, but like this specific line and it is bomb. You also get lip liner, a brush, and these palettes are also available at some Targets and Walmarts and they're super affordable. So here they're only $7. They're really, really good quality. I love Profusion. Seriously, it's one of my new favorite affordable brands. And there's also some Beauty Blender dupes here which look really, really pretty. I definitely don't need any more Beauty Blenders, but this is a pretty good steal. It's only $6. Okay, so now I'm in the skincare. There's definitely an overload of products here. Um, so I see some Glam Glow, Dr. Brandt, some Bosha back there, which these are pretty pricey brands. And then one of my favorite brands is Shea Moisture, and I'm really actually intrigued by this Coconut and Hibiscus Radiance Mud Mask. It is $6, and it looks pretty good. No sulfates, no parabens. The ingredients look pretty good as well. So I think I'm gonna give this a try. There's also this Shea Moisture Clarifying Facial Wash and Scrub. I've used this before and I really liked it. And this is $6, so I'm gonna give this a try. I'm currently using their bar of soap as my cleanser, like morning and night, and I really like it. Okay, this definitely caught my attention. This Rose Gold Eye Serum, luxury anti-aging treatment. Helps repair fine lines, under eye bags, dehydration, which is exactly what I have. This is $6, looks pretty good, so I'm gonna get it. Okay, we found some more Anastasia, the Subculture Palette, Too Faced Bonbons Palette, Color Story. I've actually heard of this brand, I think, from Instagram. Mm, doesn't look too shabby. This is $5. Um, some more Too Faced. There's lots of Too Faced and Anastasia here and Absolute New York as well. More Profusion back here. Glam Face Palette. And then <laughs> even more Profusion here on the bottom. And this is really cool actually because it comes with an eyeshadow primer and everything. Little brow kit over here. This looks really good for like a makeup artist because it has like variety in here. <gasps> They have PH Cosmetics here. Royal Affair 20 color eyeshadow palette. $8. This looks really good. I'm gonna get it. I love BH. I actually just made an order with them last night. I'm gonna do a full face of them very soon. So stay tuned for that. This is what the cart is looking like so far. By the way, my bag is from TJ Maxx. It's Steve Madden. It was like $35. So we're almost finished. We have one more little section. 
and we'll be done. But you know I can't help myself because this is Profusion, so I'm actually gonna get this palette. I have so many of their palettes. They're just so good, and they're so cheap, but they're so good. So I'm gonna also get that as if I need any more eyeshadows. Okay, we have some e.l.f. and we have some Salon Perfect and Ardell lashes here, which I am living for. These look so similar to the 614s from Salon Perfect, which I love, so I'm gonna get these. There's also a ton of single shadows from Anastasia, and they're only $4, which I think is really good. This shade is really beautiful, Railgar. It's one of my favorites from Anastasia, so that's cool. I usually don't really use single shadows anymore because I don't love like having a ton of Z palettes, but if you're a makeup artist, I think those are cool. I found this other palette from BH Cosmetics, which this is a collab. It looks really, really pretty, and it is, how much is it? I think it's like $7. So they have a ton of collabs here as well. Um, and then some more Too Faced, Pixie, which is kind of random, and we have some lash serums back here. Okay, before I leave, I just wanted to mention this brand, Girls With Curls. I bought these for my friend Ashley because she has super curly hair, and I'm gonna get these for her because she's been trying to find them. She said at TJ Maxx, because I got her a bunch of hair products for Christmas, and she couldn't find these anymore, but if you have curly hair, this is good, and it smells amazing. So I'm gonna grab a few of these for her. Okay, now we are done. You ready to go? All right guys, all done. I spent a total of $145, which is pretty good because I got a lot of really good things. I got a lot of stuff, so I'll show you everything once I get home, but yeah, I'm excited. So I'll see you guys soon. Okay, so I'm back home and I wanted to show you guys everything that I got, just a little up close shot of each thing. It doesn't seem like I got a lot of stuff, but when I was checking out, it did. <laughs> but now that I laid everything out, it looks like a little bit of stuff, but that's typically how it always is when I go shopping, but. Anyways, the first thing that I got is the Profusion Contour Complete Shape and Sculpt Kit. Even though the packaging is not my favorite, everything that you get in here is such a good value. This is only $8, and I mean, you already get eight contour and highlight shades, so it's a really good deal. So I love the fact that you have a variety of cool and warm tone shades. I love the brushes. Profusion brushes are really, really great quality, and they're so affordable. So I'm really excited about this. I'm going to be featuring this in makeup tutorials, and I'm pretty sure Casey Holmes was raving about a contour kit from Profusion. I don't know which one it was, but I remember the packaging was like this, so I'm excited about that. And then I also did get the Profusion Wonderless palette. This was, how much exactly? Oh yeah, $7. Such a great deal. Once again, I'm trying to open this with one hand. There we go. Um, Profusion shadows, I've just raved about them for forever. They are incredible, and this palette just looks stunning. I think this is going to be a really nice, like, pop of color palette or perfect for spring and summer. And I love this old dual ended brush that comes with it. So, cannot wait to use that. And then I also did get the Tahari Beauty Radiant Glow Illuminating Powder Palette. This was, again, $5. The shades in here just look so stunning. I love the fact that you get a mirror. I mean, look at how beautiful that is for five dollars i don't know how the quality is going to be but i mean i'm very impressed with just the packaging and how everything looks right off the bat so can't wait to use that i can't wait to use everything obviously <laughs> uh, and then i did pick up the anastasia matte lipstick set this was 17 dollars, and you get six lipsticks in here which i thought was actually pretty good considering how expensive just one lipstick is like i said i tried these before i wasn't a fan i only tried one though so i figured you know let me give these another chance because i love anastasia and then i did end up getting more brushes i know please don't be mean to me in the comments i I know that I have a lot of makeup brushes but I'm always just down to trying new ones and I really like the brushes that I have tried from Japanesque so far and they're just so affordable I couldn't pass it up I couldn't so this one is the stippling brush which I would use for blush and then this one is the must-have highlighting duo which I would use this for highlighting and this probably for contouring so I just thought this was like such a steal I mean the brush was four dollars and these are typically a lot more expensive like at Walmart and stuff and this one was five for two so I mean okay moving on I also did get the rose gold eye serum luxury anti-aging treatment this was six dollars I ended up getting the lashes as well because I love these and I'm always wearing falsies and I also did get the royal affair palette from BH cosmetics I mean look at that that just looks so stunning and it looks different like than anything that I have in my collection you also get a mirror and then I also got the makeup revolution ultra pro glow 2 palette and I really like the peachy tones in here like the golden shades I think this is gonna be really nice with a tan so I'm pumped about 
about that and this was only like five or six dollars or so looks just so stunning i did get the burt's bees sweet orange lip balm you guys know i love my menthol lip shine from bath and body works and my laneige lip sleeping mask but i thought this was just nice to just throw in the bag whenever i need some lip balm i also got the Too faced lip injection glossy in babe alert this just looked so beautiful wait till you guys see this color it is stunning the color just looks so pretty like perfect for spring and i love glossy lips so i couldn't pass this up and then i also did get the steel light glitter and glow liquid eyeshadow this one is in into the blue look at this color like i could not pass this up i know it's kind of hard to tell but it's just like a blue purple uh, it's just stunning and i figured i would do maybe like a really colorful look using this and this wonderless palette from profusion so be on the lookout for that but yeah i love that shade and then i also did get the Shea moisture clarifying facial wash and scrub i got three packs of these wipes they were only four dollars a piece cucumber rose water and the coconut milk and almond i go through these a lot not just to take off my makeup but just like in general when i'm filming and stuff like to spot clean makeup brushes and just like i use these a lot so these are a must in my vanity and then i got the curly hair products for my friend Ashley. I love this brand. It just smells so good and she loves it too so I couldn't not get these for her. And these were each $6 a piece so I got two of each. And then finally I got the Shea Moisture Radiance Mud Mask and this was $6. I'm probably going to use this tonight so I'm excited. Alright guys so that completes this shop with me. I really hope you enjoyed it. As always don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel and let me know where I should shop next. Thank you guys for all of your love and support. I love you guys and I will see you very soon in a few days in my next one.